Some good old-fashioned Nightfall. Let's see if it's playable post-rotation. I like keeping this because it could kill uh, Nora. Not bad. Okay. Bit awkward. Two win cons. True. Oh, well, aren't you the cutest thing of a D I ever did see? I couldn't hear your answer about Behold the Infinite. I think Behold the Infinite as a card is a little more playable because Targon is able to go more late game with the help of Cosmic Youngling and Falling Star. So they're turning into a bit more of a control region because they're able to go slower. But you do have to remember that it's probably still not going to be good based on the stuff that's already in the meta. You're playing a two-mana burst spell to get a potential win con or something that's awful. So yeah, that's just possibly not great. I'm gonna guess the plus two, plus two, yeah. Yeah. Okay, that's fine though. We have a pretty good turn coming up. We can play the uh, ephemeral one and then just double elusive. Oh, they play that card. Huh. Let's do um uh, Hmm. Diana levels. Invisible to the ignorant. That's gotta be worth it, right? It shouldn't be easy for yeah. Oh, okay, that's good. Why are you two mana? Oh, that's by the moon's crescent blade. That Diana skin is so freaking good, by the way. Death Buster Shot. Okay, is it active? I don't think it's active. I cannot turn back. I will be heard. I said fuck. This is uh this is our wing con. We're attacking on evens. Okay, attack on even is not great. That's pretty good. Oh dear. Fear not death. Nah, I just take it. Bless the faithful and fear the heretics. Then an artwork check. So good. Level one and level two are spectacular on this skin. We are all seeking an end to war. Oh wait, they are what the hell? They are playing that part. That sucks. Yeah, now I'm not so sure anymore. Unseen, unheard, the new moon conceals you from our foes. I think we have to do this. Night flowers upon my blade. The promise of a new moon upon you, Bloom Tender. Bloom and fade with the morning. That's probably not good for us, to be honest. Oh, they missed. Are we actually chilling? Didn't Stalk and Shadows get rotated? Oh, clearly not, because we're playing it. <laughs> That's the best they have. Whatever the cost. Yeah, it's not lethal. They're at four. Stay, listen. Sure. It's not over yet, but we're looking pretty good right now. We still have the Stalking Shadows to get even more cards. This is another win comp, potentially. If we draw second Nocturne, we can actually kill this too. What? Thank 
they forced us to choose death or the blade. They couldn't kill Nocturne or Diana before efficiently, so if we just open attack next turn and we pull this, we we might be good. We can also uh, Dusk Pedal onto the Dusk Rider. I'm just like, the, the reason I had to play Nocturne here is just this minimizes this attack, right? They, they have no Fearsome Blocker except this, and it has Vulnerable. So I think we actually just win, even without Nocturne. Okay, it depends on how many pings they have. Horse Wincon. Temperamental as Did I just... We must work together. You cannot hold us down. The thing about blocking like this is right. Oh, any spell. The thing about blocking this is it's a it's a fearsome blocker for them. So this doesn't really change much. This changes nothing. Block with a two three. Why? It doesn't die, and they still have a fearsome blocker if we do. This becomes a 3-4 next turn. I think this is correct. Even if we lose our 11-4 to Disintegrate, I think this is still fine. Yeah. Be because it changes nothing. The only thing that could screw us over is a portal high roll. Which is entirely possible. But uh, the Broadmain dying is a big deal here. I think we're just attacking. We have, we have, uh, but okay, the thing is they healed. So if they kill Nocturne here, it's not lethal anymore. I actually think we have to develop. We have to develop here. If it wasn't for the Cosmic Youngling, I would attack because then these two would just be lethal if they killed Nocturne. But now if they kill Nocturne, they're at one. Like, uh, playing these two should also just be fine. That should be GG. Yeah. Alright, nice! Awesome! I, man, broad main decks are something else. It feels good beating them with a deck like Nightfall. It was the same with Seraphine. Seraphine's package had all the cards she needed in her own region already. So I was like, why would I... Why, why would I not just play Seraphine with all 10 regions? Ionia SI was also seen? Yeah, exactly. Wait, what the hell is this thing? Oh, you got, uh, you got Mastered Lurk? Nice, dude. Good stuff. Wanna hop into the game, but gotta wait till the next patch, because wonky new players here. Oh, yeah. Oh, dude, that's a thing. Yeah, I, uh, I'm working on a beginner's guide, and I've been in touch with Riot about that. And, yeah, they're... They're acknowledging that, too. And it's... It's a mess. But they're, 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 they're gonna handle it well. Uh, yeah. Yeah, they have a solution. It just sucks that we have to wait. But yeah, if they if they run into stuff, what can we do as players? I think we're just taking that one because we can play one this turn. We were peaceful once. Cold and unforgiving as moonlight. Cloaked in silver light. I cannot turn back. I will be heard. Sure. I don't know if you have that info and can't tell, but in your personal opinion, which champion's region would be great as starter decks? I always, I always think that the Masha is good as a starter deck. The Masha just teaches you really good fundamentals. <laughs> oh no. Anyway. Blue. Oh, that, uh, oh no, I misplayed that. I misplayed that. I should have done the uh, the sapling toss. That, that was wrong. That's kind of cool.
Could you make a Karma Aesol deck? I'd rather not, because that's basically set Karma without... Without some of the stuff. Without set, I guess. I guess that would be the only difference. I guess. Diana gets Challenger anyway. Your heretic. Oh, did you? They will all scream as one. <laughs> I feel like opponent kind of missed the combo early, and we just ran them over because Nightwall. Yeah, it, it is aggro. Let's be honest. Moon casts her light across the land. Tomorrow, and that should be the finale. How many cards have changed in this deck since rotation? Well, there's no Stygian Onlooker, there's no Doom Beast. So, a good amount, sadly. But this is really good. This is this is why Sapling Toss is in this deck, right? So it's uh, Sapling Toss into the Shade Stock. They forced us to choose death or the blade. It's good to not to play. Have played this, I guess. I think it matters, but it would have been a little more efficient. How do you feel uploading a new game? I, I'm, I'm very happy that I'm able to do it. And I think, like, while well, obviously my views are lower, I still think it's a big win. Uh, be because it is getting views at all, right? Like, all videos are above 10k views, and the first one did, like, insane. So I think that's just... probably the best I could do, the, the most I could ask for. Well, that's two teamers down. So we, uh, this is going to be the third champion we kill. Right? 100%. We have Dust Pedal into Glenkeeper into the Unspeakable Horror. It's got to be. Their scent travels on the night air. I think... Mm, Red 1. They mom's do like a yordle in uniform. And we yordles in uniform do like a wolf. Um... Hmm... This is interesting. I actually think we're pulling this then, so we can full attack. That's 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 seven extra damage. That's got to be worth it. And we have a fearsome, or I mean, an elusive blocker. This has to be worth it. Surprised he's not using Mystic. Maybe he has one. Yeah. I love the smell of mushrooms in the morning. quite a collection. I don't really care about the Teemo because I'm trying to win before Teemo can do real damage. So this, this feels like it's the best possible thing for us to do. Yeah, that seems good. Last Saturday I was infected with a stomach virus and all I did was lying in bed watching the challenge stream. That was a really good to help me healing. Oh, nice. Yeah, I'm really glad that, the, that you enjoyed that. I'm doing another challenge stream on Sunday. Uh, I can't do it on Saturday because I have the Rune Terror Jeopardy. With Mogwai and Aragorn. So, uh, yeah, that one will have to wait. So, we're just gonna get a Nightfall unit here. I mean, it's good. It's not good right now. So, yeah, uh, Sunday will be another YouTube stream. Surely we're good. 
24. Yeah, it should be fine. Uh, well, that does change some stuff. Don't those fools know I own this city? I mean, it's more experience if we level Nocturne. Is this still lethal? Surely it is. Wait, no, it's not. Bonk, bonk. Two, five. They block the five. They block the six. Yeah, it's still lethal. Right? We pull that with the two. I'm, I'm doing... Ah, whatever, man. Wait. Two, five, six. It's eight. Yeah, okay, it's lethal. <clears throat> one mana deal one. Pythos. Oh, if it's Pythos, it's not lethal. <laughs> I'm doing it for the extra experience, okay? They block here, yeah, it's 8 damage. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> if it was Pythos, it wasn't lethal, dude. OMG, I play versus Sunny himself. What's up? Well, are, you, are you my current opponent, or were you the previous opponent? Yo, overthink, listen. When you level up a champion, you get bonus experience. Look at that min max. Yeah, it's important. It's it's. Uh, I, I gotta get my level of my champions to level seven. No wait, that's League of Legends. I gotta get my champions to level five. Oh, this is Freljord? Again? We played against three Teemo decks, and they always had Teemo on one. X. I may have to play this. I made roughly 3 on LP. Yo, nice. What deck? So anyone win, but with as much champion experience as possible? Exactly, exactly. It's important. Like I I my 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 mission, my goal is to have all Targon champions level 5. And I'm pretty sure Diana is the lowest right now. I think she's even lower than Melfide. I'm pretty sure. Well, you're certainly the fuzziest partner I've worked with. What's Aesol at? Level 5. Of course. Of course Aesol is level 5. The Teemo Kate SI Ramupa? I did see that. It looked pretty good. I'm picking that because we desperately need more activators. If you level knock or your Diana experience increase, no. They're separate. Lurg and the Quiver. Ver I, I really like Vera Samira. Vera Samira actually gives me Riven Victor vibes. But that's just because Victor is basically, you know, that. Oh, I kind of think those now. Yeah, normally you kill the 3 3. Normally you kill the Peddler, but, uh. Yeah, not with this deck. We shouldn't be drawing too many cards. Nightfall. I don't think it's great. It's okay. We will be free. Cheeky bloke, mate. I miss Aphelios. Yeah, me too, dude. Every day. And I can't even play him, play him in league because he's just miserable there. Uh, okay, so we want to go wide. So it is. It's gonna be weird, but it's gonna be Diana into the Twilight Protector. Embrace the night. Because we need to play the Whining Light next turn. Yeah, that's the only way, right? Yeah. It's 
exact like I didn't really try to set this up. I don't want to date. I don't want to pretend that I'm smart when I'm really not. But having that one spell mana is pretty perfect here. Here we go. Make or break time. Okay. Temperamental as moonlight. Okay, this should be somewhat hard for them to deal with. <laughs> I hope. But Harsh Winds kind of does it already, doesn't it? Karina, what brings you here? Business and pleasure share. There's no way. Oh. Aim to win, and my aim is excellent. Wait, ten. I don't think it's enough. For truth. This is the only play we have. I will be heard. I'm, I'm, I, I mean, this is the only play we have because if we pull anything else to the start, it's not lethal, and Caitlyn will just block the second one, right? Actually, wait. Come on. If we do this, this is six. This is six, and this is eleven. Right? Six, 11, we're three off. And then, then Caitlyn will block whatever is here. That's not a draw. That's not a draw. No, it's not. It's one off. So we, ha we have to. This is the only play we have, like this. But I think we still lose. Alright, GG. <laughs> that was. Like, I thought the Karina was just GG if we didn't die immediately, but the, the Caitlyn being on the board is. Not great. You spoil the surprise? I don't think Battle City is super strong. It's okay. It, it was uh, it was stupidly strong when Pokey Stick and Nora were in the game. I think it's like fine. Uh, yeah, GG. <laughs> we were always at this rooms here. Nah, the game's over, dude. We drew like what six rooms. Alright, whatever. I, I, that, that's acceptable. That's acceptable. The Lunari will not live in fear. I mean, they have the Castigate. There was like the Senna Castigate deck. I don't think that deck is bad. That's about it really right now. Uh, Shroom is pretty dead. What was I? Guns above the champions in the versus screens? It's from the Gauntlet. There is a competitive reward track. I miss my spicy zillion TF deck. Yeah, same. Night flowers There's a lot I miss. Every work demands a piece of our their scent travels on the night air. Is your event pass max? No, it's not. I mean I also took like four days, three days off to play Mate Seeker. So I missed a bit of progress. But uh once we get the Aurelian Soul skin, we're gonna play the sweetest Aurelian Soul deck you've ever seen. It's gonna be Asol Orn Ramp. We played a bit on stream the other day. And it, it was just really fun to play. That's all it was. Just, just a fun deck. Just a fun, fun little deck. Joy is a good look in a book and a cat in a lap. It's gonna do that to activate the pill. This is not Diana, so. Oh, that's a good card. Okay, wait, how do we do this? So we can make this a 3-3, three, three, and then this will activate Diana. Or we can just do this and this and have two challengers. I think this is better. This is better this turn. It's more efficient, and then we can keep this for like a different nightfall activator later on. Do you think if I if I put these numbers into my phone, I could talk to my opponents and tell them to throw the game? Surely. Lunari, rise. I will be heard. This feels like a form up, but whatever. Sure. I'm pulling this because we already have an uh, elusive blocker. A 
What the hell? Every work demands a piece of our a good cup of tea. We're just gonna play this. And then next turn we sapling into Nocturne. And that should be lethal. Oh no. Anyway. Off we go. Yeah, Doom Beast and Antidusk are very good. That is true. I have one more form up, it's not lethal. Form up here. Yeah. <clears throat> they already use one form up though. I don't know what else they could have that buffs their board, but it does kind of make us lose to champion strength next turn. So, form up does do it. Oh, nice. Alright. Yeah, if they had four of this turn and champion strength next turn, as like their exact two cards they had left, it would have been devastating, but... We need Fiddlesticks ASAP. True. Play the Gauntlet, it's internal. Yeah, I, I, I told myself I was gonna skip this eternal format, and I really dislike that if I start now, I'm gonna have one badge instead of all of them. It, it's gonna look so scuffed. I wouldn't mind playing one game though. Maybe next stream or something I'll do one game because the format does seem pretty fun. What's up, Moonburp? We were peaceful once. These woods protect their own. I can't tell if playing this on one is correct. Yeah, we're just gonna keep this until six. We just need a wide board. Dusk approaches. I might be pretty sus if they pass here. No more lies. I mean, do I really have a chance? Or a choice, rather? Don't think so. Swing it. That's fine. Okay, let's see. Um, hmm. It's a good draw here. Pretty good, actually. Kind of sucks. I felt so awkward. It really is, man. Her flowers bring the moonlight with them. I walk the space between worlds. Cold and unforgiving as moonlight. The top deck, that right? Must. Night descends. I will be heard. Okay, we're just setting up for. Uh... This. <laughs> Alright, Diana number three. Enforced equilibrium. So we double block. We play these two. And then next turn we use the pedal for the winding light. J4? Oh yeah, it's probably J4 actually. Yeah, it's gotta be J4. I th I th that's not the end of the world if it's J4. I know you. We will resist. It's annoying, but... 
Night flowers upon my blade. The promise of a new moon upon you, Blue Tender. Find your path in the dark and follow no false light. Surprised I didn't attack with Shen. Okay. So. Boom, boom. Man, it feels pretty good that the Masha doesn't have Concerted Strike anymore for their mid range decks. Cards suck to play against, man. Nightfall is not a bad mechanic, but the decks suck. I think it's... I mean, I don't want to, like, flame the developers, because overall, I think they do a really good job at making archetypes fun. But I feel like Nightfall was just a big miss. I, I don't think they should have ever made an aggro deck. They should just looked at, um, like, how Hearthstone does it with their combo mechanic, honestly. There is no dispute. Would you rework Nightfall or give them an OP card? I would I would give them a different archetype. I think it's too late for that. I'm gonna be completely honest. I don't think that's possible anymore, but I think it'd be really cool if they had an actual a full moon control. I don't wanna say control, but more mid rangey instead of just being awkward aggro. So if you like look at Hearthstone. Look at look at Rogue decks. Nightfall could be like Fissimera, exactly. I think I think Nightfall should have been Fissimera. I, I, like then you don't have to deal with like how broken the elusives get too, right? Samira's unbalanced. Oh yeah, Samira. Like I think I think that deck, like once people get good, like really good at Vera Samira, it would be a tier tier zero deck. Night flowers upon my blade. I'll scout ahead. Hello, Legend. Temperamental as moonlight. Embrace the night. Samira Riven Victor is more broken than all of the Engon. Oh my god, you're right. Samira Riven Victor. It's literally like old Riven Victor, but better. Oh my god. Wait, that's so crazy. That has to be Turbo Nuts. Ballistic Bot is a 1-3 again, too. I cannot turn back. I will be heard. Do, do you actually run Ballistic? I feel like you have to run Ballistic in that. Yeah, you have to. This is crazy. Like, that, that that's so good with Samira, too. Baddies beware. Mama's got a gun. Let's cook them. We will resist. And he's playing Timo Nora, probably champion strength deck. Probably. Damn it, man. These turns are so. Look at this. It's just a handful of Nightfall units. I wish Diana would make Dusk Pedal. Dusk Pedal Dust? What the hell is that stuff called? Dusk Pedal Dust. No more lies. I wish. Your I will be heard. An inconsistent Nightfall Activator? Man. That's gotta feel so good to play, huh? I guess Aphelios was kind of dead. You can pre-ignition and activate all out now. You have combat trick. Oh my god, you're right. You're right. What is this hand? What is this? Bro. The new moon conceals you from our foes. What am I doing next, sir? Am I just playing another Shade Stalker into Crescent Guardian? We lost the flight. Oh, the flight would have been so good. Words move hearts and hearts. Arise in our time of need. Flowers. <laughs> okay, man. What? 
Wait, okay, but... But Doctor is leveled. This is actually just a million damage. Right? What does SI provide us? Tears. <laughs> Misery. Yeah, that's pretty bad. I don't think you should even... Yeah, that's why people are playing this with uh, Leona, right? Why don't we just go to SI to get coins? To SI? You mean build sweater? Well, that's not lethal. I will be heard. Come, a new phase awaits. They will all scream as one. I feel like Nightfall might actually be saved if uh, if it's playable with like a region that doesn't rely or it doesn't have such a hard time activating nightfall like what if it's actually just like builds water with shelly and stuff you have to dust pedal dust he'll cascades I feel like that might not even be the worst weirdly darkness hides my mirror nightfall honestly that could be it too easily But if you use some, yeah, no, you're right. I mean, we get the, we, we just, we just have to block like this. Next turn, we get the sapling, and when we get the sapling, they'll all get minus one attack. Not that it matters. We're all ready. Like they're already don't have a fearsome block except this. I like that interaction a lot, to be honest, but leveling Nocturne and getting that off is so freaking hard. Alright, GG.